uploaded the video for last week and now starting off week number 15 welcome back to the Iron Man Road to Completionist Cape series starting off the week by uh, doing a daily challenge turning it in nice 35k thieving which gets me a level 75 which makes the uh, exoskeleton suit yeah it acts like um, what's it called acts like uh, what do they call it? Gloves of Silence now. Uh, so that's really good. Going to help my thieving XP out uh, quite a bit. And on to more stuff. Turning in a U Shield Bow daily challenge as well. Let's see. Uh, nice. 60k fletching. And some magic logs. Did a little bit of Hunter. And. Uh, where is it? Empty. Oh man. Uh, and I actually don't have enough inventory space for everything. This is the first week I'm doing all of them at the same exact time. You can see all the skills. Uh, if you actually want to check, you can. But it is every single one. Uh, empty it again. After I finish. There we go. Last two. Construction and Hunter, I think? Yeah, there we go. Another statue explosion. And, uh... I was about to go do some skilling, right, but I thought I should go ahead and get my strange rocks for this week. Now, it's a little bit late on putting this up, and I also, like, missed my Tears of Gothics last week. Uh, it's not too big of a deal. Um, yeah. Okay, time to go do stuff. Working on some fishing here at uh, Barbarian, still trying to get that last golden fish egg. And... Here we go, 459k XP from the Fishing rod Matic. Gonna go grab another one. Uh, that's 68 Invention. Let's see, getting close to 69 as well. Uh, not too much inspiration, but hopefully I'll get some uh, while training. Or maybe I can get a uh, Golden Fish Egg here, let's see. Oh, there we go. That's some serious luck right there. Golden Leaping Salmon, exactly the one I needed. That's the last one there is here. Um, so I can go train somewhere else. Uh, not sure where, but it will be somewhere. Okay, I just got back-to-back -back goldfish eggs from Prawn Balls. I didn't, you know, I wasn't recording it, so I can't really prove it, but it was back-to-back. -back. I got one, I was like, oh, click. Oh, there's one left, I may as well use it. Uh, yeah. The Swordfish, Rocktail. Then there is Lava Eel and rainbow fish and i think that would be all of the prawn perks unlocked i think so and now it's day 100 uh, i've been working on fire making for a while just for something to do aside from other stuff uh we'll probably do some wood cutting later on uh, but you can see here little 83 already i believe i started at 78 something like that uh and that unlocks curly roots um, don't know if I'll end up doing these or just stick to th something like maples because it's a lot more AFK uh, and I'm going to have plenty of maples but uh, yeah that's what I've been working on for a while uh, pretty much like all day I got like 700,000 fire making XP between last night and this morning um, gonna do all my dailies and stuff and uh, yeah just did some uh, harping and then some summoning on half an hour and uh, now doing my daily challenge, which are Moss Titans, uh, 21k summoning from that. And there's a level, uh, as well as some Murray Golds, okay. Uh, Spirit Dagonoth Pouches, which is good, because I have a lot of Dagonoth hides saved up from Celestial Dragons. And uh, DK is when I did them way back, uh, which will be for some good summoning XP. Um, so now I'm just under 7 mil away from Pakyax. So, starting off day 101, or not really starting, uh, been a lot of the day already, uh, here at crafting, uh, at harping, yeah, uh, now I'm level 92, uh, harping, <laughs> um, yeah, that's, that's something, haven't, uh, had much time to do anything else today, I'd, I'd like to do some, uh, some ranged XP, uh, I'm gonna have to do that, like, all through the week, uh, doing ranged and slayer, um, so that I can guarantee that extra 99 for the week. Um, and yeah, this is what I've been working on. Not much else to clip about. And here's my weekly Tears of Guthix. I think I've missed this for like a week or two, but not too big of a deal. 
and 54,000 thieving, which is, I think, about half a level. Uh, it's pretty good. So I've been varying up my uh, divine locations each day, uh, just because I got tired of being kicked for hopping too many times and then having to wait like five minutes uh, whenever I was trying to find divine shark bubbles. Um, so, uh, what I've been collecting is some extra energies. Uh, I've been using them for uh, divine charges, as well as getting the signs of the porter uh, for, you know, I think I'll find a use for them eventually. And I've also been collecting a lot of herbs, uh, which are clean. Yeah, I've been cleaning them and putting them in, so you can see. Just got this tab building up quite a bit for some herb lore XP, and uh, prepping to make, you know, extremes and overloads before too long. And now it's much later in the day, uh, day 101. Uh, did some fishing and finished up this one fishing automatic. Want to get this on tape because. Oh, 69? Wait, really? I thought it was level 70 guaranteed. Ah, uh, 28k away. So close. Um, charge rate reduction 4 is really good. And junk drain reduction, uh, or junk chance reduction 4 as well. I'm uh, going to put these into the new fishing rod, uh, then turn in a daily challenge, which is planting harmony moss seeds, you know, like 4k farming. Meh. And it's now day 102, starting my, uh, or doing my daily jack of trades, and I wanted to note that the channel just hit 200 subscribers, which, uh, that's a really good way to, uh, to start the day. I think I set it 199 for, like, the past like full 48 hours or something like that I just kept looking to see if it would ever tick over <laughs> um, but I'm really glad that uh, people are enjoying the content and I hope that I can continue to keep the quality uh, of my my content uh, consistent or even improving uh, even with the uh, newly burdened schedule that includes uh, school uh, because I, I do have school in like an hour but I have to start walking in like 40 minutes and I uh, have reading to do before then and yeah oh man uh, probably going to work on some ranged later on today uh, and do some slayer just remembered I got PK'd a little while ago in the wilderness uh, while I was running around trying to get cursed energy I think or something like that um, I ended up losing my war priest boots and I haven't had another pair drop since uh, so I'm going to be doing some Slayer without boots. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, and there's 96 Slayer, which means I've unlocked all of the Elite Slayer mobs. Uh, don't know how many of these I'm going to be doing. They are probably quite difficult for uh, my current gear set. But uh, we'll see, you know? Just been doing some Slayer, and... Uh, Sunspear hit level 12, so going to siphon it. That's the last siphon I already have made. Uh, oh, wait, yeah, that's right. That's uh, 70, which means I'm level 70 in all skills. Is that going to pop up? Yeah, there we go. Uh, it doesn't actually say it, but nice. <laughs> um, unlocked all kinds of stuff. I uh, don't think any of this is really useful. Maybe the uh, party simulator. That might be useful uh, later on. Um, yeah, cool. Uh, on to the next clip. Uh, oh yeah, what I was saying is uh, uh, I don't have any more equipment siphons already made, and I, I don't really feel like making more, I guess. Um, so I'm going to start disassembling this again, especially since you know I've got plenty of cash, and the cash stack is building up, and uh, it effectively doubles your invention XP rate. So uh, that's pretty good. And right after that, total level 2300, uh, because I got Invention 71 from uh, discovering something. Whoa! Leveled up and got 8600 Inspiration. That's crazy. Like, 8661, I have 80, 8999. <laughs> wow, so I can actually uh, uh, discover all of these things. Nice. On to day 103, and, uh, well, another day, another task. Uh, still grinding away at ranged, uh, 2.6 million away from 99. I think um, I may end up like not having a 99 this week and just getting two next week uh, because I'll be really close to two next week, but I do have some schoolwork and stuff I need to take care of before uh, 
Thursday when the week rolls over, and I'm not sure that I can also get done the, the extra 2.6 million range I got to go. Um, but I feel like I can knock out 2 million of this, and then a lot of Slayer, and, you know, Slayer ranged HP are all getting really, really close to 99, and uh, those will count for, like, the next three weeks. So, uh, I'll get them eventually. And with the end of that Celestial Dragons task, I hit uh, 200 Slayer tasks complete for 300 bonus points. Puts me at, like... Yeah, almost 700 Slayer points, and I just canceled a task, so it would have been a 728. It's pretty good. Wow, I just had a double beam drop. It was a uh, Ferocious Ring and a Quartz Summons in the same Steel Dragon kill. That's a pretty rare one right there, I think. So I've been claiming my uh, card every day from the garage over here, and I finally got a consistent Yak card, which is going to be a free recipe for uh, the, the potions in Melior Clan. And on today 104, uh, ended yesterday doing some harping, and today I'm um, going to do the new Slayer assignment I got, which is Aviancy's, uh, that I might end up camping Kree a little bit longer. Uh, I still have a Reaper assignment, I believe. Let's see if it'll, uh, my current assignment, there we go, uh, it's Vindicta. Uh, so I'm going to hold on to, or I'm going to actually go do that one, uh, maybe, uh, with my Vampirism Aura, or I might buy like a Magic Aura, something like that, since I now have, uh, a little bit more in terms of loyalty points. See, 23k. Um, I think I was planning to use that on penance or something. And, wow, that's a weak hit. <laughs> um, so yeah, doing my Jack of Trades and going to kind of focus on this this evening. So, finished up that trip at Vindicta and now uh, can turn in this challenge, uh, which required me to kill, like, mobs over level 130 or something. Uh, it took a little while. Uh, I think I'll put it in... I don't know. And I don't know why these stats are boosted. Oh, I guess it's because I prayed at, a, at Ireworth. Um, I guess I'll put it in ranged, just to see the level. Why not? Yeah, there's 97 ranged. Uh, nice, only two left to go there. Uh, not going to get it this week, I don't think. So, um, yeah. Uh, but now it's time to go camp at Cree. And... Um, yeah, I am going to get two 99s next week, though. Promise. Hey, I got another drop at Armadil. You can probably hear the little beam sound. Uh, it's another hilt. That's depressing. So, I half lied. I did pay attention to the game for a while here, but, you know, then I went back to my normal AFK spot. The harps. Um, I know it's fairly inefficient, but... Hey, you can't deny that it, it does give you progress. There's 93. Uh, pretty good. Uh, I want uh, crafting to be one of the first 99s I get after my next few combats. That being a you know, Slayer ranged and, and uh, HP and defense. Um, so I want to go ahead and get that up there and like prepare it. And then you know I'll have Dungeoneering and... Yeah, I have no idea where to go after that. I've got a few weeks to prepare and start getting my skills up into the 90s uh, so that I can try to keep on schedule. Um, you know, prayer will probably be one that I do over time. Uh, I don't know, maybe I'll start doing like AFK fire making or fletching or something like that. Okay, um, but yeah, there's a last clip for tonight, day 104, and... Uh, Maybe I'll do something significant tomorrow. I'm not sure. I just hit, like, a tipping point in the Minecraft mod pack I've been playing with my roommate, and uh, everything just got, you know, really fast, uh, fun, um, but hopefully I'll be through that before too long, and, uh, yeah, I might do some Slayer tomorrow. I have this Order of Ascension members that I just want to do, um, and I might actually try Legios for the first time, so that'll be fun. And finally... Logging in today, it's day 105, let me edit that, and uh, just after the daily reset too, let's see, uh, Ceridoman Brews daily challenge, that's nice, and here's turning in two daily challenges, uh, decorated cooking urns for 46k, not bad, and Ceridoman Brews for almost 25k, that's nice as well, uh, uncut dragon stone, so meh, and seven quorum back for my uh, ten uh, Sarah Brews. I uh, also want to re-roll this Blood Runes, because uh, these RC daily challenges are useless. Smith, uh, Steel Ceremonial Swords. Um, I don't think I have enough iron for that, actually. 
Uh, so I think I'm going to flip over to this one. And I, I don't know, I might mine some iron? Probably not. Uh, I'll just hold on to it and see if I can get some iron ore drops, like, randomly. Maybe somewhere drops them. I have plenty of coal, 5200 here. Uh, but I don't think I have much iron in the artisan's workshop. Uh, if I could use steel bars, that would be fine, because there's almost 700, but uh, as is, that's not really going to work too well. Uh, also going to go do my daily limit up here in the Garage of Dungeon. And there's a level 88 herb lore. Been running through my herb lore supplies fairly quickly. And, um, yeah, that's extreme attacks. So my first extreme to make, then one more per level, and, uh, yeah, overloads before too long. Not bad. Nice, finally got a drop from Vend. It's a Xerosian Essence. I'm pretty sure uh, that's a pretty expensive drop normally. Nice. Okay, not an expensive drop. I got confused. But it's something. It wasn't a normal drop table for once. And there's the end of that Reaper assignment. Uh, 17k Slayer, 13 more points. That uh, puts me at 25 assignments complete. Uh, I believe that also leaves me at 238 uh, Reaper points, and I hit 89 defense there on that uh, second to last kill. On my uh, first reroll, I got 26 from Grador, so I think I'll go take care of that uh, eventually. I'll wait until um, my vampirism comes back off cooldown. Uh, or I actually didn't use it. Uh, this is uh, this is uh, the next ore I bought, Greater Runic Accuracy. Um, so yeah, I'll go there eventually, but I want to try out Legion's now. So, that six kills of Primus down, no problem. Um, just want to record how many kills that is. Uh, gonna go back to the bank and show off how many keys I have right now, uh, just in case it takes forever to get Ascension Crossbows. Alright, so I had six Primus, uh, that's five Secundus, five Tertius, eight Cordus, five Quintus, and five Sextus. So pretty much five across the board. Uh, hopefully, I can get at least one Signet from all of this. There it is! Holy shit! Ah, there we go! The first one, number four. Oh, well, Ascension, yeah, there we go, okay. <laughs> uh, not bad at all. So that was, what, six, five, five, and number three. Uh, so that puts me in a total of 19. That's pretty lucky. Not bad at all. What the hell? <laughs> What? <laughs> this <laughs> four kills later. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> oh man. Okay, so there's the offhand, right? <laughs> Oh my... I... I... I <laughs> that was my first Quintus. <laughs> what? <laughs> and it's from Quintus, which is the worst. <laughs> Oh, this is the best day. I'm. S <laughs> this is like RuneScape telling me to get off my ass and actually play the game. <laughs> well, that's the end of the kills, but, uh, you know, nothing to be upset about. Uh, like 30 kills for three signets, uh, which is pretty stupidly lucky. Um, yeah. Let's see if it, if it actually tracked it. I wasn't, um... I can't remember exactly how many keys it was. I did count them beforehand, but let's see. For the record, 34. And I got 3. Wow. Oh, uh, that's what it was earlier. I got the... That Xerosian Essence confused with a Crest Drop. Yeah, okay. Uh, crest Drop would have been <laughs> a whole lot better. But I think all of my luck uh, was put at Legion's for now. So I saw it was a half an hour, I start doing some agility, and then I realize it's midnight, and I lost track of time uh, playing RuneScape. Um, 
Oh yeah, my new task is Black Dragons, so I'm going to uh, probably do QBD with that. Um, may cut it short, uh, but I still want to get a RCB eventually, I think. They're good for uh, augmentation, as far as I know. Um, so that'd be good to pick up. Um, but yeah, I'm going to call it uh, end for the week. Uh, tomorrow I'll be doing my Bandos task and my uh, Black Dragons here on QBD. Uh, but this is where I'm at for now. Uh, only 23.06. Um, I didn't get that many levels this week. It was just a lot of uh, AFK stuff. I mean, you all just saw it. Um, but next week I do plan on getting at least 299s. I'm not sure which... Well, okay, I'm pretty sure which. But it'll be between HP, Ranged, and Slayer. Uh, I may actually get all three of them. I'm not sure. Uh, but if I get all three, then I won't have a 99 You know, the week after. Um, so yeah, that is the plan for next week. Also, uh, gonna keep um, working on farming, start doing my farming runs again. I've been neglecting them for too long, it feels like. Uh, and I might do some thieving next week, too, because I want to get my um, lower levels up, and get, you know, 80 plus uh, everything, uh, 80 milestone cape kind of thing. Um, but it needs 77 farming to start doing, uh, you know, wood cutting and mining really AFK uh, for really good XP. Uh, so yeah, that's the end of the week. Uh, thanks for watching. Um, be sure to like if you liked it. Uh, comment if you have anything to say or any tips to throw at me. And, uh, or, you know, freak out about my signet luck. And uh, subscribe if you haven't yet. Oh, I need to empty my hands. There we go. Okay, see you all next week.